Welcome back. It's the 10th, a Tuesday. Morning. Morning? I heard Kurijo Senpai is coming back today. Oh, that's, that's good, that's good. Yeah, how is she? Huh? I don't know. What should I even say to her? I wouldn't be surprised if she's not up for talking, though. Yeah, my advice would be... Very much give her her space if she needs it. Just see how she is. Just just do the normal day-to-day -day stuff. Say hello. Treat her like you normally would not just gauge it from there, really. It'll be difficult. It'll be difficult. After school, anyway. Plus... Has ended for today. Right, so what are we doing today? Hmm, it's good for your skin. Oh. So we got Bebe or Hiraga. I think we'll go with Bebe. Just because we've been doing his recently. So it feels right to continue, Bebe. Bebe! Greetings! I have been waiting for you! It seems the threads of fate have brought us together. Could you spare some time to talk? I suppose. Go to Fashion Club. How flattering! Oh, joyous day! Then let us speak. We have a sewing machine in one hand. You're not meant to hold on to it, mate, like in your hand. Like you leave it on a table. Very heavy equipment. If you didn't know that, by the way. So sewing machines, very heavy. Very heavy. I would expect so, though. Listen well. I am listening. Go ahead. You're not saying anything. I have come up with a great idea to get my uncle to appreciate Japan's charm. Oh? Is it a devious, cunning plan like I hoped for? I will show him a kimono. When he sees it, uh, he will understand the beauty of Nihon. I mean, it's entirely possible. Hmm, I like the idea. The, the only question I have is, it's like, we, we don't really know much about your uncle to judge the situation properly, I feel. Like, he, he could take it as a good thing, a bad thing. I can't remember if he brought up a, like, is he into fashion or anything like that? Because if he's into fashion, maybe that would work very well. Like, he likes different design styles and stuff like that. And it's like, well, if you're learning that over there, that's lovely. That's great. Stay there. So, we'll go with that logic, maybe? That's a great idea. Kui, with you in my corner, I have nothing to fear. I don't know about that. The kimono is a Japanese treasure, full of culture and history. If I show it to my uncle, he will surely let me stay in Nihon. As for the design, it will be inspired by the mascot of Azuki Arai. Simple, but deep. Deep. I choose this design because, well, you are the one who took me there. Oh? Bebe really seems to trust me. I feel like we're growing closer. Rank up, everybody! Temperance. Rank 7. I can see everything clearly now. Everything? I shall hurry and make the kimono. I must sow. Sow like the wind. The wind doesn't know how to sow, mate. It's a force. A lot of energy in the air and stuff. I spent the day working with Bebe, and then went back to the dorm. And that I did. Evening! Oh, my box is here. A box of stuff. Japanese Don and Homunculus. Welcome back. Hello. Mitsuru-san has just returned to the dorm. She looked really tired. She went straight to her room without saying a word. Hmm, she'll be fine. She just needs to process this, yeah. Yes. I hope so. So do I, so do I. Hmm. What 
options do we have available to us? We have a Ken linked episode, I assume. Hello, Yuki-san. I'd l like to ask you a favor. Are you available tonight? I'll be waiting in front of the dorm. Oh, I know this is a difficult period, so thank you for your time. Okay, looks like Amada wants to hang out. Should I meet up with him? Yep. Yeah. Let's head to where Amada is. Da -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Hello. Senpai. Oh, Yuki-san. I know you must be busy, but do you have time to come with me tonight? Seems like Amada wants me to accompany him somewhere. Should I spend the evening with Amada? Spend time with him. Thank you very much. Thanks. Wasn't sure if I'd be able to go there alone. I'd like to head over to Port Island Station now, if that's okay with you. Yeah, it's okay with me. So then, I took it apart and put it somewhere. <laughs> I want to go to a bar called K Sarah Sarah. It's down this way. He took it apart and put it somewhere. What what could that even be? I was thinking of getting Mitsuru-san a gift. Oh. And I heard I might be able to buy what I'm looking for at the bar. Hey, what's up with them? Who knows? What's a kid doing here? All the darts. Maybe it's too dangerous, but supposedly it's only open at night. Just stay close. Oh, okay. Hmm. Huh. Is it a bit further down? <sighs> now there's little kids running around. Oh, it's become so wholesome here. Hey, it's past your bedtime, little boy. Mommy's waiting for you. <laughs> Ooh, really the wrong thing to say that again. I don't think we should do that. That could cause more problems, so ignore it, ignore it. They don't know. Thank you, but I'm alright. If I let it bother me, then it'll never go away. I just want to finish what I came here for. This looks like the place. The owner here is really particular about the taste of his drinks. They say he has ingredients you can't normally find. Oh? And for one of the cocktails he makes, he uses an extremely rare tea leaf. Oh, well, now I'm definitely in. Hmm. You did your research. I borrowed a computer from Fuka-san and gathered some information. Good old Fuka. Mitsuru-san seems to know her teas well. So I figured I shouldn't give her anything weird. I hope the bar owner is willing to share some of it, though. Well, he looked scary, but at least he agreed to sell it to us in the end. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Boy, I'm glad that worked out. I can't wait to give this to Mitsuru-san. With everything that happened, I'm sure she's been having a hard time. Yeah. Yeah. And again, pretty much everyone in the dorms can relate in some way. Again, even myself, I can relate in some way. It's sad and painful to be in a home knowing that you'll never see a loved one there with you again. So, I'm hoping this makes things more pleasant for her, at least while she's at the dorm. Although, it is Mitsuru-san we're talking about. So, I'm sure she'll be fine. Oh yeah, she'll she'll be fine. She'll be fine. I just thought it would be nice if she was able to think about things over a delicious cup of tea. I like your thinking, Ken. I like your thinking. Hmm, you've grown strong. I like that. Yeah, I like that option. That's cool. You really mean that? Yeah, yeah. You're thinking of others... In the time of need, going out of your way to get a present for them? Like, yeah, yeah, you're doing good here, kid. I was just thinking about when the same thing happened to me. I, I knew you would be. Well, we should head back before it gets too late. Ugh. 
well, <clears throat> it's it's very much a, a case of like, come on, Makoto, come on, you you should have some idea of what he's thinking about here. What's wrong? Nah, it's nothing. Oh. Thanks for joining me today, Senpai. Oh, no problem at all. And sorry for making you worry about all that stuff. Worry? We haven't really talked properly since what happened to Aragaki-san. Yeah, there we go. I keep thinking about the last thing he said to me. I have to live for myself. But how exactly do I do that? I wasn't sure where to start, but I've been trying all kinds of things. Things that the old me would have never considered. Like hanging out with my friends at school, reading manga, and even watching TV. I'm also trying to make an effort to talk to people in the dorm more. Mitsuru-san helped me with my homework the other day, and I even beat Junpei-san in a video game. <laughs> oh, I bet he did not like that. Oh, I also ate snacks with Yukari-san and the others, and Aigis san helped me feed hamburger. I realized that little things like this can really make life enjoyable. I would have liked to see Aigis help with hamburger. Well, that's what I've learned so far. Hmm. Keep it up. I don't want to say that's more than enough. It's like, no, keep what you're doing. It, 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 this is good, Ken. This is good. But that just seems a bit over the top there. Seems a bit presumptuous. So keep it up. I will. I've done enough thinking. Now, I just want to try doing all kinds of new things. I think I have an idea of how to live my life again. You know, I've noticed other people in the dorm talk about you a lot. Oh, really? Everyone seems to be really happy when they do, too. The hard battles continue, but we're still able to keep going. And it's because we all know when we come back, they'll always be there for us. Aww. Hmm. That'd be nice if it were true. I'm sure it is. It's not just that you're the leader during our battles. I feel like you're always looking after us. And making sure we're okay, too. I want to be more like you, Senpai. I want to continue learning from your example. That's okay, right? I think it would be okay, yeah. Anyways, sorry that all took so long. The night air is getting chilly. Shall we go back home? I mean, it's right over there, so... I listened to what Amada had been up to as we went back to the dorm. We don't need charm. We're done with that. We're done with that. That was lovely. I like that. On the 11th. A Wednesday. Oh, what are they up to now? I can hear people talking. Hey there. Hey, have you talked to the new transfer student yet? Isn't he handsome? Oh, totally. Yeah, I have. Ryoji, right? He's so sweet and dreamy. Also, he looks rich. I'm going for him for real this time. For real? What? That's not fair. I call dibs. The first bell has rung. Oh my. Damn. Ba da da ba da da. Class has ended for today. Yukari was so close on Yukari. So close. Like that, I just need a chance. I need a day where nothing happens so I can go to the shrine. But that isn't gonna happen anytime soon, I imagine. So, um, again, we've got Bebe. We've got Yuko. I'm thinking... Let's see who's higher. Y Yuko or Bebe? You're rank 7. You're rank 5. Alright then, Bebe, it hello, is. Hello. Mikado Dodo, are you busy? 
uh, to master the way of the kimono, I have need of your strength. All right. I feel like I might grow closer to Bebe soon. Go to fashion club. I, must sew. I am eternally grateful. Then today I shall sew as I have never sewed before. Oh my. Sewing is my life. Apparently. My wallet may be light, and my materials may be cheap. But. But I will work out to make a beautiful kimono and save my future. You work for that future, mate. I helped Bebe work on the kimono. Hmm. Hui. This is starting to come together. Manzoku. When my uncle sees this, I know he'll agree with me about how great Nihon is. Hmm. Yeah, we'll encourage him there with. He'll definitely agree. I believe you. Which means I must work even harder. We'll get to it then. I made so much progress today. And I could not have done it without your help. Well, I'm glad I could be here, mate. Merci. Arigato. Thank you. Pepe seems truly grateful. I feel like we're growing closer. Rank 8, 2 to go. Oh, my arms are so very tired. I must have overworked them. Maybe. But no matter what's the cost, I will finish this kimono. Don't push yourself too hard that you hurt yourself though, mate. For my future... For Nihon, I cannot give up now. I spent the day helping Bebe, then went back to the dorm. Even then. Right, what are we doing? Oh, welcome back. Hello. No, oh, nothing more to say to me. Okay, I see how it is. Um, okay, so we got... Akihiko. Got I guess. What stats do we have available? Over at the mall, because the stats are the key thing for me right now. Do 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 make sure I've got the right persona. Yes. Okay. Alright, magic. Going for it. Comes first for me at the moment. Very interesting game. Magic is raised by three. The 12th, a Thursday. And that's why... It's November already. The third year students must be cramming frantically by this point. Don't worry though, you'll share their fate next year. I can just see you now tearing your hair out. Anyway, it's a bit cold today, but there's no need for the heater. Let me tell you why. Winter is supposed to be cold. You have to learn to appreciate the temperature rather than curse it. And you can appreciate the temperature by turning on the heater. Because you appreciate the fact it's cold by warming it up. What kind of logic is this, mate? That's the Japanese way. Do you understand me? You don't, do you? A say Shonagon once wrote in her famous pillow book, Winter, Early Mornings. Yes, that's right. Hmm, let's see, Yuki. What? What was she describing with such a sparse line? Well, I'm assuming her favorite time in winter based on everything you're telling me right now, so. Well, the answer was pretty obvious. All right. So you do have some basic sense. The author was describing her favorite time in winter. She's now famous for having written about her likes, dislikes, and other observations. She admires what the snow represents, the beauty of the winter frost. Rather than curse the winter chill, she appreciated its positive qualities. Yeah, again, you can do that while from the comfort of a nice warm room. Oh, how wonderful Japanese culture is. Despite its modern youth, anyway. Alright! 
And if you think my hair is frosty, remember that you'll eventually be just like me. I answered correctly. Everyone in the class is looking at me with respect. Not that it matters. Ba -ba -da -ba right then. What we got? After school! Class has ended for today. I was going to say, you don't normally stun there. So what's going on? What, what, you got your linked episode, have you? Very well. Ryoji. Although it is like, what else would we have around today if I had the option? It would only really be Hiraga, wouldn't it? Like, because the elderly couple over there were done. So it's like, yeah, it would only be them. I say them. Only him. Only him. Right, so. Linked episode it is. Hey there. Oh, Makotokun, are you free? I'm going out with a few ladies later, but I guess some of their friends want to talk with me first. Maybe we can all go together. Wouldn't that be so much more fun? I think they're waiting for me on the roof. I want to come along. Ryoji's invited me to join him. This might be a good opportunity to get to know him better. Should I spend some time after school with Ryoji? Yep. Thanks. Great, then let's go. Alright, lads. Um, it's nice to meet you. So, you said you needed to talk to me? Yeah, keep your hands off our girlfriends. All I've been hearing her talk about is Ryoji-kun. Are you not going to say the heart? Yeah, you need to stop talking to every girl you see. Oh, um, sorry. I actually have no idea which girls you're talking about. There's been too many that have come up to me. Ooh. What? Is this a joke to you? I like how even Makoto was like, dude. I'm sorry if I offended you, but I haven't made any moves on anyone. I just invited them out for a bite to eat. That's exactly what we call making a move. That's a problem then. I've made a promise to go out with them. I can't just cancel due to my inconvenience. C quit messing with us! Ryoji could be in danger if this continues. I should probably intervene. Give me your phone. I'm going to delete all the contact info you have. Hmm. I'm going to go with the calm down. Who the hell are you? This is none of your business. Are you taking his side? Hey, it's that guy from 2F. Yes, it's me. That guy. I heard he's friends with Sonata Senpai and the student council president. They live in the same dorm. What do we do? If he tells them, then... <laughs> Look, just... Stay the hell away from our girlfriends and delete them from your contacts. Got it? Uh, all right. I'll do it. Better watch out, or he'll steal your girlfriend too. What? You wouldn't do that, would you, Ryoji? <sighs> Sorry. I didn't mean to make trouble for you. Yeah, they were the problem, not you. It's... <laughs> It's just, sorry, I didn't mean to make trouble for you. Well, you did. So, there you go. Um, I mean, it's like, <laughs> I want to do those, but I want to do the well you did, because I think it'll be funny. <laughs> I've got to go for it. Huh. Guess so, huh? I really didn't expect them to be so angry. It was just a joke, Ryoji. Right, from now on, I will ask if they have a boyfriend first, before inviting them out. Hey, thanks for having my back. You're very kind. <sighs> what a great view. The ocean looks so beautiful. There's that boat again. <sighs> I do like seeing it from the monorail to school each morning, but it looks so 
different from up here. Hmm. I wonder why those guys were so mad. If you're in a relationship with someone, that means you like each other, right? Yes. I don't think me getting in the picture would change that, would it? I wonder what it means to like someone. Do you have someone like that? Ooh. I feel like the... They're too blunt. I like this one with Ryoji here. Because it could lead to more interesting dialogue. Uh, that's a secret. <laughs> is that how it is? Well, maybe you can tell me once we get to know each other better. Maybe, maybe. I guess there's still a lot that I don't understand. Look at the world out there. The people in the city, our classmates in school, and you. Ah, <sighs> the city. I want to know more about all of it. All right. Uh, since I dragged you into this mess today, let me make it up to you. I'll treat you to ramen. I just had some with Junpei-kun the other day. You did? And while we're at it, maybe you can show me around town. I'd like to know what kind of places you like going to. I spent some time with Ryoji, and then returned to the dorm. I feel like I understand him a little better now. Oh, all stats of the equipped persona have been raised by one. Which is, you know, great for me. I see you're back. Where have you been? Seen you in days. Oh, wow, I saw you yesterday, actually. You were over there, weren't you? Oh, someone wants to have a lovely brushing. Okay, we got Fuka as well. Well... Let's go see what's available at the mall for us. What are the stats at the moment with my persona here? No, I, I just wanted to look at his stats. 61 for magic. If I can get the, that to 99, I'll, I'll, I'll be very happy. Let's, let's put it like that. I'll be, I'll be very happy. Okay. Strength? Nah. Right, let's see what we can do then at the dorms. Wait, this is a point. Like, so obviously we got Fuka upstairs. Let's look here. Your theogy. Hmm. Because obviously... We can get more there, because you got the two on the characteristic. I could have just gone left. I was trying to find the one where I had two, so it's like, I'm wondering what Fuka would get. We get another stat, another characteristic with Fuka. Like, okay. Um, yes, can I help you? What are you doing? Say. I brought more books from my home. Doesn't seem like Fuka will gain any more new skills, even if we read together. Um, hmm. Sorry. Maybe not then? Like, I'm still gonna do it. I mean, what else can I do during um, this evening? We've already got quite a bit with Koromaru, so... Um, what else are we gonna do? Unless... Oh. I haven't checked... Sorry. In a while. I'm just trying to think, like... We could use the computer, but we can't do anything there. But I haven't actually spoken to the guy in Club Escapade who sells information. Go have a look for yourself. You're curious one, aren't you? Well, go on and take a look. Ah, see, here we are. Because this could be interesting stuff. Raise agility. Dating site note. Wait, what? Why have we got several for... Like, why... Why would we need to buy several? I bought two, but why would we need to buy two? Why is there only one there? I don't know, that's strange. And let's just make sure at the strip ball here. If there's anything we can grab. Up top. Oh, I forgot. Of course, we could do Wild Duck Burger as well, couldn't we? We'll do Wild Duck Burger. Do, do, do. Come on in. Hello. Ooh, pick up line master. 
All right. Brain training. The Sengoku Chronicles. Part-time master. Just get all of these. Because if we're running out of things to do at night, well, we may as well grab these things and see about doing them. But, yeah, I forgot about Wild Duck Burger. All right, too crowded. Oh, very well. I tried, I tried. Alright, so let's see what we can use here. Hmm. I want to see about this dating site note. The fact I can buy more, it's interesting to me. A note with the URL of a matchmaking site with a prepaid offering pass. The site seems to require an offering. Luckily, the note came with a free pass. Thank you for uh, the offering and welcome to the matchmaking super shrine. Picture anyone you wish to intensify your relationship with and click the button below. Oh! Who should I think of? Yukari. Because then I would be able to, like, max out um, her social link. I'm assuming that's where we're going. I'll think about Yukari and click the button. Praying. Current progress, 3%. Continue focusing while you wait. The progress bar seems stuck at 3%. I'll continue thinking of Yukari. Prayer complete. Your relationship has intensified. It seems the prayer is done. Having meditated on our relationship, Yukari feels more important to me. There we go. Okay, this is cool. No wonder we can buy more then. I feel like the bond I have with Yukari has grown stronger. Like, this is going to help quite a bit. Because again, if we've not got much to do during the night, do this. Perfect. If you would like to ask for another prayer, please purchase another offering pass. Yeah, it's gotten late. I should head back to the uh, my room, not the dorm. I was going to say the dorm, but my room. <laughs>